Hey guys, this is Conspiracy Todd again with this week's video proving that the uh, moon landings were fake. All right, this week we're going to look again at John Young's Lunar Salute on Apollo 16. But first, I found this website talks about jumping high. How can you jump high? The science behind jumping high. The number one factor, very, very important, it says, is your velocity at takeoff. So let's look at the velocity at takeoff here. Okay, here we go, a big one. So we're just talking about how fast his feet are leaving the ground, okay? And this is me. Don't judge. How fast are my feet leaving the ground? I think they're leaving the ground a whole lot faster than they are here on the moon. So again, watch how fast his feet leave the moon. I think they're leaving the moon in slow motion. I don't think that's the way it should happen. Let's just do a little thought experiment here. Let's say we have a little switch on the wall where we can turn the gravity up or down. And I'm jumping off the uh, ground at this, you know, my feet are leaving, my whole body is leaving the ground at this speed. If I turn the gravity down, is that going to slow me down going up or is it going to speed me up going up? I think it'll speed me up going up because if you turn the gravity down, you're turning down the resistance. So there's less, and I weigh a whole lot less. Let's say it turned it down to half, one half gravity, one half earth gravity. So instead of weighing 200 pounds, now I weigh 100 pounds. When I jump, I'm going to come off the ground faster than if I weighed 200 pounds. And conversely, let's say I turned it up to uh, one and a half G's, one and a half earth gravity. Now, instead of weighing 200 pounds, I weigh 300 pounds. When I try to jump, my muscles are going to be working against more gravity, and so I'm going to be jumping slower. So I think that NASA got it wrong. I think they got it 180 degrees wrong when they got these guys uh, coming off the ground in slow motion. Now, I agree the rest of it would probably look like it's in slow motion, but their initial velocity off of the ground should be as fast or even faster than here on Earth. Just think of it uh, as uh, you're in a swimming pool and you're punching into the water. It slows your hands down versus air. You know, air is less dense. Well, same thing with gravity. If you've got more gravity that you're working against, your muscles, you know, like a weightlifter that's lifting a bunch of weight, when they come up, they're slower than whenever they don't have any weight. You know, they're using their muscles to the fullest extent when they're lifting those, uh, you know, let's say a 200-pound weightlifter is lifting 200 pounds. They're coming off the ground, or they're coming up slower because of the muscles that have the resistance than if they had no weight on them. So anyway, I think that NASA screwed up right here. They got this totally 180 degrees wrong. When these guys are jumping off the ground, they should be, they should be jumping up off the ground faster than here on Earth. Now, they're going to spend six times more time in the air. You're going to jump six times higher. Actually, I think you would jump even higher than that because your muscles are accustomed to Earth gravity. And when you get on the moon, you're going to be able to, your muscles are going to jump faster and uh, be stronger in comparison to your body weight. Because um, I think that six times factor is assuming that your muscles exert the exact same force, initial force, when you jump. So if you're on the moon, I think you're going to be able to exert a lot more force and thereby jump more than six times higher on the moon. But today we're talking about the initial speed here. Anyway, guys, what do y'all think? I think NASA scientists got it 180 degrees wrong on that video. I think that uh, when his feet left the ground, they should have left... They should the velocity, the initial velocity should have been at least at the as fast as on Earth, if not a whole lot faster. Please comment below, subscribe and like, and uh, tell me what you think. Thanks. Bye.